गुड मॉर्निंग माई डियर स्टूडेंट्स आई वेलकम यू ऑल इन द ऑनलाइन सेशन ऑफ मैथ्स इन यस्टरडे सेशन वी हैव लर्न अबाउट सब्ट्रेक्शन इट्स फैक्ट्स एंड नंबर फैमिलीज इन टूडे सेशन वी विल लर्न अबाउट सब्ट्रेक्शन विद रीग्रुपिंग एंड चेकिंग सब्ट्रेक्शन सो लेट स्टार्ट चैप्टर थ्री सेशन टू so our next question is look at the dominoes and write down the two addition and two subtraction facts so children in this we have to look at the domino and we have to write the two addition and two subtraction facts for this first we will count the dots in the first part 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so first we will write 7 Now we will count the dots in the other part. One, two, three, four, five. So we will write five. So first we are writing the two addition facts. Now bigger number in mind and smaller number on fingers. So seven in my mind, five on my fingers. After seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So we will write twelve. now we will interchange these numbers so first we will write 5 and then we will write 7 now we will add these numbers so 7 in my mind 5 on my fingers after 7 8 9 10 11 12 so we will write 12 these are the two addition facts now we will write the subtraction facts so we will write total number of dots that is 12 now we will subtract 7 from 12 so we will write 7 so how we will subtract after 7 count till 12 so 8 9 10 11 12 so how many 5 so we will write 5 here now we will subtract 5 from 12 so we will write 12 minus 5 so after 5 count till 12 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 so what will come 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so we will write 7 so these are the two subtraction facts so children 7 5 12 5 7 12 12 7 5 so these three numbers 5 7 and 12 these three numbers belong to the same number family okay see one more example look at this domino so first we will see the first part now we will count the dots 1 2 3 4 5 6 so we will write 6 now we will see the other part and we will count the dots 1 2 3 4 Five. Now we will write five here. Now we will add these numbers. So bigger number in mind and smaller number on fingers. So after six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So what will we write? Eleven. Yes. Now we will interchange these numbers. So first we will write five and then we will write six. Bigger number in mind and smaller number on fingers after 6 7 8 9 10 11 so we will write 11 now we will write the subtraction facts so first we will write 11 that is the total number of dots now first we will subtract 6 from 11 so we will write 11 minus 6 after 6 count till 11 after 6 7 8 9 10 11 so what will come 5 very good so we will write 5 here now we will subtract 5 from 11 so after 5 count till 11 6 7 8 9 10 11 so what will come here how many 6 so we will write 6 so in this question 5 
and 11. These three numbers belong to the same number family. Now our next topic is subtraction with regrouping. See the first sum 35 minus 7. So children first we have to start from the ones place. 5 minus 7. 7. Is it possible to subtract 7 from 5? No, it is not possible. So what will we do? Yes, we will borrow. So we will borrow from 3. So 3 will become 2 and 5 will become 15. Now after 7 count till 15. So 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So what will come? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So, 15 minus 7 is 8. Now, 2 minus, as there is no number, so we will write 2 down. So, what is the answer? 28. See the next sum. 47 minus 9. So, first we have to start from the 1's place. 7 minus 9. Is it possible? No, it is not possible. So what will we do? Yes, we will borrow from tens place. So 4 will become 3 and 7 will become 17. Now 17 minus 9. So how we will do? After 9 count till 17. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So now count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So what will we write? 8. 17 minus 9 is 8. Now, as there is no number, so we will write 3 down. So what is the answer children? 38. Okay, see the next sum. 43 minus 27. So first we have to start from the ones place. 3 minus 7. Possible? No, it is not possible. So what will we do? We will borrow from tens place. So 4 will become 3 and 3 will become 13. Now 13 minus 7. Yes, it is possible. So after 7, count till 13. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So what will come? 6. 13 minus 7 is 6. Now 3 minus 2. After 2 count till 3. After 2, 3. So what will come here? 1. So we will write 1. So what is the answer? 16. Okay, see the last sum. 57 minus 28. So first we have to start from the 1's place. 7 minus 8. It is possible? No, it is not possible. So what will we do? We will borrow from 10's place. So 5 will become 4 and 7 will become 17. Now 17 minus 8. Yes, it is possible. After 8, count till 17. After 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Now count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So what will we write? 9. 17 minus 8 is 9. Now 4 minus 2. After 2 count till 4. After 2, 3, 4. So what will we write? 2. So what is the answer children? 29. Our next topic is checking subtraction. Now see the first sum. 31 minus 17. So first we have to start from the 1's place. So first we will subtract 1 minus 7. Is it possible children? No, it is not possible. So what will we do? Yes, we will borrow from tens place. So 3 will become 2 and 1 will become 11. Now 11 minus 7. After 7 count till 11. 8, 9, 10, 11. So what will come? 4. So we will write 4. Now 2 minus 1. After 1, count till 2. After 1, 2. So what will come? 1. So what is the answer? 11, uh, 31 minus 17 is equal to 14. Now, we have to check the subtraction. 
So what will we do? We will add the answer to the smaller number of the subtraction problem. So what is the answer? 14. So first we will write 14 and then which is the smaller number 31 or 17? 17. So we will write 17 and then we will add these two numbers. So 4 plus 7. Bigger number in mind and smaller number on fingers. So 7 in my mind, 4 on my fingers. After 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. But 11 is a two digit number. So what will we do? We will break this number. This is the ones digit and this is the tens digit. Ones digit that is 1 will go to the ones place and tens digit will go to the tens place. 1 plus 1 is 2. Now 2 in my mind. 1 on my finger. After 2, 3. So, we will write 3. So, children, see the answer. It is 31. It is the same number with which we started the subtraction. We have started the subtraction with 31. It is the same. Means, our subtraction is correct. Okay, see one more sum. 81 minus 59. So, first we will subtract the numbers. So, first we have to start from the 1's place. 1 minus 9. Is it possible? No, it is not possible. So, we will borrow from 10's place. 8 will become 7 and 1 will become 11. 11 minus 9. After 9, count till 11. After 9, 10, 11. So, what will come? 2. So, we will write 2. Now, 7 minus 5. After 5, count till 7. After 5, 6, 7. So what will come? 2. So what is the answer? 22. Now, we will add the answer to the smaller number of the subtraction problem. So which is the smaller number? 59. So first we will write the answer that is 22. And then we will write the smaller number that is 59. Now, we will add these numbers. So first we have to start from the 1's place. 2 plus 9. So, bigger number in mind and smaller number on fingers. 9 in my mind, 2 on my fingers. After 9, 10, 11. So, we will write 11. 11 is a 2 digit number. So, what will we do? We will break this number. This is the 1's digit and this is the 10's digit. 1's digit that is 1 will go to the 1's place and 10's digit that is 1 will go to the 10's place. Now, 2 plus 1 is 3. 3 plus 5. Now, 5 in my mind, 3 on my fingers. After 5, 6, 7, 8. So, what will we write? We will write 8 in tens place. So, it is 81. It is the same number with which we started the subtraction. We have started the subtraction with 81 and we got the answer 81. That is the same number. Means our subtraction is correct. So children, I hope you all enjoyed this session. Thank you.